Welcome to the 2024-25 CFIS Advanced Gifted Programming Information Session. This electronic presentation has been designed to provide you with helpful and timely information while maximizing your time during this busy end of the school year season. I'm Becky Quinn, the Director of Curriculum and District Gifted Coordinator. Families of current third graders may have already viewed the Transition to Fourth Grade session also posted to the website to learn more about the CFIS experience. The goal of this presentation is to provide families of current third through fifth graders with information about each existing gifted advanced program, describe how students show readiness for each program, describe the varied advanced gifted services available in math and ELA, provide information about academic enrichment clubs available within CFIS, and connect families with the most appropriate contact to answer specific questions following this session. The Ohio Department of Education and Workforce requires all districts to identify students as gifted when they meet or exceed identified scores on approved assessments. This includes scores at or above the 95th percentile in math and reading on tests like the iReady assessment in grades 2 through 8 or the COGAT in grades 4 through 6 with a composite score of a 128 or higher. While each district must identify these students as gifted, there is no requirement for districts in Ohio to provide services to these students. Our district has made a strong commitment to offering multiple and varied programs which match areas of gifted identification and include other relevant data points. That is why we call these programs advanced slash gifted. We use the term advanced in our district to reflect those students who might not yet have a gifted identification, but meet other identified data points to show readiness for more rigorous coursework. You may wish to refer to the selection criteria, which is simply the specific data points used in determining individual student readiness and eligibility to move into an advanced gifted program within CFIS by clicking on the handout number one link on the web page. We recognize that each student grows at a different rate each year. Thus, we believe in collecting and using multiple and varied data points each year to identify students who are ready to join advanced gifted programming over time. Students who are newly eligible for one or more advanced gifted programs in the 24-25 school year have received letters indicating this new eligibility. These students will be automatically placed in the identified program or programs unless a parent guardian requests otherwise. If your child was eligible for an advanced gifted program in the 23-24 school year in fourth or fifth grade, he or she will continue on in this program or programs unless you request otherwise or a decision has been collaboratively made with your child's teacher to change this placement. Students who become newly eligible for an advanced gifted cluster within their grade level are seamlessly moved into this placement during each school year. If you have questions about specific data points relative to your individual child, please click the links posted to the webpage to email Elizabeth Wolfgang, the CFIS school counselor, Curtis Howell, the CFIS principal, or me, Becky Quinn, the Director of Curriculum and District Gifted Coordinator. If you have questions related to the expectations within the math program, please click the link on the district webpage to contact Nick Leskowitz, our K-12 math coach. If you have questions related to the expectations within the ELA program, please click the link on the webpage to contact Katie Gill, our K-12 ELA coach. Advanced Gifted English Language Arts Services in grades 4 through 6 are provided through a cluster model within each ELA classroom. All ELA students engage in reading and writing units identified per grade level using high-quality literature available at varied Lexile levels. Each ELA teacher has an extensive library of books within his or her classroom for students to access. While all students in an ELA class may begin the class with a common mini-lesson with the teacher, and all students may be engaging in reading the same genre of books or producing the same type of writing, narratives, persuasive essays, etc., the remainder of the period yields ongoing opportunities for the teacher to work with advanced gifted cluster students. 
Differences between what students in these clusters may do relative to what other students in the class may do may be viewed by clicking the handout number two link on the website. The instructional time provided within ELA classrooms across grades four through six allows for differentiation to occur and for students to be fully engaged in reading and writing. Because all ELA classes include advanced gifted clusters, students are able to move into an advanced gifted cluster as they meet eligibility throughout each school year. The handout number three link on the website provides an overview of all of the ELA courses available to students in grades four through 12. As you can see, all students can access advanced honors, AP, and College Credit Plus ELA courses as they approach middle school and beyond. The intent is to maximize the potential of each student for providing the most appropriate coursework for them each year. Here you can see the selection criteria or data points used to determine student readiness for service in an advanced ELA cluster. Students can seamlessly move into this service as they show readiness throughout each school year in grades four through six. Advanced math clusters have been designed to extend the advanced math cluster service provided in grades two and three. They're intended to enable students to access more challenging math materials throughout each school year. Each grade level math class, math four, math five, and math six, contains an advanced gifted math cluster making it easy for students to move into this service as they meet eligibility during each school year. The advanced math clusters enhance the breadth and depth of grade level math instruction and provide enrichment and extensions, which occasionally reach into above grade level content. Through participation in an advanced math cluster in sixth grade, students may be ready to move into advanced math application seven, which compacts seventh and eighth grade math into a single year, with Algebra One for high school credit following in eighth grade. Students following this trajectory will easily be able to access AP Calculus and or AP Statistics by the end of high school. The addition of math clusters ensures that the varied needs of our advanced and gifted math students are met each year. Please see handout number four posted to the website to view a comparison of the grade level math course to what occurs within an advanced gifted cluster and what occurs within our math plus or advanced math courses. To view all of the possible math trajectories for students across grades four through 12, please access handout number five. This document illustrates the multiple and varied ways the diverse and changing needs of our students can be met as they grow in math over time. The data points or selection criteria used for advanced gifted math cluster eligibility are less intensive than the criteria used to determine readiness for the advanced math courses, Math 4 Plus, Math 5 Plus, and Math 6 Plus, and seek to include students whose math ability is emerging. It is not unusual for a student enrolled in an advanced math cluster one school year to grow and earn new eligibility to move into an advanced math or Math Plus course the following school year. These students are provided with an online math bridging pathway and support to seamlessly move into this placement the following school year. We constantly collect student data to determine this readiness throughout each school year in grades four through six. Next, let's take a look at the advanced gifted math courses currently in place within CFIS. The advanced math four or math four plus course moves at an accelerated pace, including fourth and some of fifth grade math content, and provides advanced gifted services to all students enrolled in the course. It provides ongoing access to enrichment and emerging access to accelerated content as the year progresses. Advanced Math 5 or Math 5 Plus moves at an accelerated pace, including the remainder of fifth grade math content compacted with all of sixth grade math content providing advanced gifted services to all students enrolled in the course and ongoing access to accelerated content. Students enrolled in this course will take the sixth grade math Ohio State test during spring testing. The Advanced Math Application 6 or Math 6 Plus course. CFIS offers enrichment clubs which may be of interest to advanced gifted students and are open to all students. In CFIS Live, any interested students in grades four through six 
work as reporters or producers to capture the latest news relevant to CFIS students and present it in an appealing way. Through their work, students learn how to conduct interviews, how to engage viewers, and how to conduct investigative reporting. Invention Convention is another after-school enrichment club. Mr. Hell, the CFIS principal, and I understand the value of clear and ongoing communication. All information and handouts referenced in this session and the transition to fourth grade session will remain posted to the website throughout the summer months. Letters have been mailed to families regarding current program eligibility and will continue to be sent as the end of year testing occurs through May and state testing results are available in summer 2024. Throughout the school year, new information relative to advanced gifted programming options and enrichment offerings will be communicated through CFIS newsletter eBlast and or mailings via U.S. Mail. We encourage families to look for information this fall regarding curriculum night events as these will provide all families with opportunities to meet CFIS teachers and learn more about what to expect throughout the 2024-25 school year. If you have any questions, please use the contacts listed here via the clickable links on the web page to reach out to the CFIS school counselor, Elizabeth Wolfgang, the CFIS principal, Curtis Howell, or me, Becky Quinn, with questions specific to your child in his or her specific data point. You may also wish to contact our K-12 math coach, Nick Leskowitz, or our ELA coach, Katie Gill, with any questions about the math or ELA programs, characteristics of the advanced gifted programs, or the possible trajectories of courses within CFIS and beyond in math and ELA. We are all happy to answer your questions via email, phone, or schedule a meeting with you as needed. We're excited about the advanced gifted programming options and enrichment offerings available within CFIS and can't wait for the 2024-25 school year.